Hi everyone, here's now a video on how to compute for the slope. Okay, slope is defined by m, so m is equal to change in y over change in x. Assuming two points A such as x sub 1 and y sub 1 and B has coordinates x sub 2, y sub 2. So m is equal to y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. Here's an example. What is the slope of A, negative 1, 7, and B, negative 5, negative 3? Meaning A is one of the point, and then that would be represented by x sub 1, y sub 1. And then we have B, negative 5, negative 3. So that would be x sub 2, and then y sub 2. Now, again, slope means is equal to change in y over change in x. Therefore, it would be y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. Now, identifying now the elements, we have now our y sub 2 as negative 3 minus y sub 1, which is 7. Then negative 5 as x sub 2 minus negative 1, which is our x sub 1. Now, changing the sign, we simplify negative 3 minus 7 all over negative 5 plus 1. Therefore, we have negative 10 all over negative 4. Let me just write this on this side. So m is equal to negative 10 over negative 4. Simplifying that, the answer would be 5 halves. Now, let's have this one. Let's just interchange now a and b, where a turns out to be negative 5, negative 3, and b is negative 1 and 7. Let's see. So a, we have now x sub 1, y sub 1 which is negative 5 and negative 3, respectively. Then we have b as negative 1 and 7, where there will be x sub 2, y sub 2, respectively. So m is equal, once again, to change in y over change in x, therefore y sub 2 minus y sub 1 over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. So substituting that, we have now 7 as y sub 2 minus negative 3, which is our y sub 1, all over negative 1 as our x sub 2, minus x sub 1 is negative 5. Simplifying that, we have now 7 plus 3 all over negative 1 plus 5. So we have now 10 over 4. Let me write it on this other side. So we have now 10 fourths. So simplifying that, the answer is still the same. So whenever you interchange whatever you want to um, assign as x sub 2, y sub 2, and x sub 1, y sub 1, the answer would still be the same. Let's have another example. What is the slope of C, 3, 2, and D, negative 3, 4? So C is 3, 2, so therefore that would be represented as x sub 1, y sub 1. And then D would be negative 3, 4, would be represented by x sub 2, y sub 2. Once again, slope is change in y over change in x, so therefore that is y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. So our y sub 2 is 4 minus 2 as our y sub 1 all over negative 3 as our x sub 2 minus 3 as our x sub 1. So working on that, 4 minus 2 all over negative 3 minus 3. So the answer would be 2 over negative 6. I'll write that on this point. So m is equal to 2 over negative 6. We need to simplify that and put the negative in the numerator. So m or the slope is equal to negative one-third. I hope you learned something on how to compute for the slope. Thank you for watching.